Hey friends, this is Big Forest Films, and right now sitting atop my table is an Ingmar, Ber Ingmar Bergman collection, uh, actually called A Selection, and it has a bunch of movies by Bergman, um, uh, roughly 20 movies, I think, um, and it's a Swedish release, um, but it is English friendly, uh, I should add. Um, since every movie is subtitled in English. Now, I thought in this um, little film of mine I'd run through my growing Ingmar Bergman collection. I'm not going to speak too much about the movies themselves. I mean, because Bergman is such a renowned filmmaker, it's sort of a, sort of a job for a film scholar to do. Uh, so I'll, I'll, I'll mainly show off what I have. <laughs> As I said, this is a Swedish release that's somewhat English friendly. It's super nice and large. Um, the box itself is roughly the size of a um, a vinyl uh, cover or laser disc cover, what have you. Um, nice material, uh, some sort of um, felt or uh, textile material. Super nice, and this Ingmar Bergman. Uh, signature in uh, s a silvery uh, writing and wait you lift this bad boy off like this and inside you find this large booklet which has an article by Peter Cowie which for those of you who don't know is one of the um, uh, one of the sources to go to when you want to talk about Bergman, uh, he's a film scholar and specialized on Bergman, and that's actually in English, uh, so that's cool, it makes it a bit more uh, internationally friendly, uh, but all the other writing is actually in Swedish, and, but inside you find pictures from the movies, the movies, and you get short texts in Swedish about the movies, you get the playing times, you get uh, some some info about who's starring in the movies and everything like that. Uh, super cool, super nice. Really recommend uh, getting this. Maybe I should show you quickly. Actually, come to think of it, some of the some something more about the content you get. This um, the movies are uh, housed in these volume uh, packages where you get the discs, the DVD discs. Uh, you'll have a hard time seeing this I think in the light and everything. But uh, they, are, they all kind of look the same. Um, but the movies, besides having English, English subtitles, they don't have um, much extras. Uh, but however, with the, the set you get some rare Ingmar Bergman films. Um, you get one about his filmmaking that he's made with his own, um, I think, like nine and a half millimeter camera, if there is such a thing. Um, and you get some uh, some of his more rare documentaries, so that's cool. Uh, some of the movies inclu included in bo this box set um, is. Um, well, pretty much the the major ones you get um, Fanny and Alexander. You get uh, the Seventh Seal, the Magician, um, Wild Strawberries. Uh, so the, a lot of the, uh, the the great one through a glass darkly, uh, Hour of the Wolf, and that's not, that's not even half of it. Um, Scenes from a marriage, the whole, the whole shebang. So super nice Swedish box set. Uh, one major trouble with it, however, maybe I should show you this is, I got it the first time it arrived at my place. It was totally messed up. The packaging had gotten loose. This sort of middle red middle of it. Um, so I sent it back, and when I got it the the second time, it was better but it's still uh, a tiny bit damaged 
Um, and I realized it wasn't because of the company's handling, but by because of the packaging itself. It sort of makes it hard to ship without damaging it uh, one way or another, which is uh, too bad. Uh, but I'm still very happy about it. I got, because of the damage uh, within and everything, I got a really nice discount. So I'm happy about this. Next up is a Eclipse release. And I, most of you guys probably know about Eclipse. Damn it, this light. Uh, it's, it's a subdivision of Criterion uh, with simpler releases, not, well, basically, very rarely it has the booklets and the extras and everything, but um, you get these cool boxed sets um, in this, these slimline cases. Uh, very nice. And in this set, you get two Joy. First, uh, you get Port of Call, Crisis, and Torment. And Torment is sort of interesting because it's not really a movie by Ingmar Bergman and all that much, but it was written by him, and it's a very early movie. It's from 1944, and a great movie at that. Um, one of those movies that um, it's not as artsy as some of Bergman's work, but you really get the psychological sort of feel for it. So that's a great movie. And then we have Sawdust and Tinsel by the Criterion Collection. Great movie. And of course, as with always with the Criterion's it has the booklet or a booklet uh, really nice glad to have this and then i have the huge funny alexander collection which has the i think about five and a half hour version and also the theatrical version which is i, I know so something about something around three hours plus so glad to have this box set. Uh, comes with a book let uh, somewhere. There we have it. Uh, a booklet, really nice. Uh, so this is a must-have because you you need uh, all all the versions of Fanny Alexander. It's it's definitely worth it either way you spin it. Inside, I'm not sure if you can see this. You might be able to see this. Actually, one of the characters from the film inside the box. So that's a nice touch. Uh, let's, then we have that, and then I have this, which is the magic flute. Uh, criterion. This is getting sort of hard to get a hold of and it's not really renowned because of its picture quality and everything. Uh, it's it's a color movie. But still I'm glad to have this. It took me some time to find it. Um, it has a really more of an insert than a booklet really. Uh, and that's, so that's cool anyway. And then I have these Swedish editions of some of his films. Um, I'm, I'm not all, all that sure about the English translation. Uh, this is Waiting Women, for example. Uh, this is, I think it's a lesson in love. And um, I'm not sure about the English title on this. Still though, pretty, pretty cool. And the crowning achievement um, in my collection, or I actually just needed to have it, and it sort of um, fulfills my collection, is this Criterion, very sort of early laser disc uh, of the Seven Seal, super nice uh, edition. And one of the reasons for me wanting to have this is, besides it's a sort of cool edition, it's 
because it has the commentary by Peter Cowley and my other versions don't have that. I might pick up the Criterion Blu-ray someday. I'm not in a hurry because I'm really happy with the versions I have. Um, this is very nice. It's a gateful with pictures and everything like that. Uh, so that's basically it for my um, Bergman collection. Um, thanks for watching uh, and go uh, watch uh, Bergman films basically. Uh, if in doubt, uh, if you want to go a, a bit deeper than The Seventh Seal, I suggest you pop in Persona if you haven't seen it. It's available in this Ingmar Bergman A Selection box set that I have. And by the way, if you want to get the uh, Bergman selection um, box set. It's available from uh, www.discshop.se and I do think they ship internationally, I'm not sure, uh, but if you want to get it, that's one of the places to find it. Thank you for watching everyone.